and we're live. You know who <laughs> eats fat and carbs? Henry Cavill, that fat. <laughs> 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 What I find interesting is Kyle's perception slowly like shifting the goalpost on what is like impressive to him now because he's actually achieved what is comparable to what a lot of these celebrities mm -hmm. look like. So like when you see no one's ever fucking said Captain America or Henry Cavill weren't impressive. You got you always take my like worst comments and you're like hyper <laughs> sorry. It's fun to me. This is the same thing that happened last time too. I had to justify myself. <laughs> but anyway, when Kyle sees this stuff, like I think he's sort of on the same page I am when I see this stuff now from like the fitness perspective. I see it too. Yeah. It, like yeah, when you say he's I'm, like look, he looks good by any normal measure. But like Captain America could have easily peeled down a bit more. Like he was not that lean. You know what I mean? Like I how could, much he, you want to suffer have, for I the think, role? I think Superman's a better example of not hot. And especially in The Witcher. Like oh yeah, just fucking I, fluffy and uh, no visible. Yeah. 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 No reason for I, Superman I, I to agree be peeled. And, and he water depleted for that scene too. And he complained yeah. about it. Like a that bitch. shows like how little he really put into it when he had to water deplete from a like and still looking like flubby when he's sitting no. in like you know, and the and he's getting paid millions of dollars. Like, Zach, grab a Witcher picture. I did this shit as a joke. God damn it! Like, <laughs> like, like, like this is about this is because this is for fun. I did this because I thought it was a funny fucking thing to do. He did this shit. He's getting paid millions of dollars, and it's his resume. Like, I got no respect now for any mixed martial arts fighter who misses weight. You're a punk. You deserve to get cut. Uh, like, like, how are you gonna possibly miss weight? Like, I, I don't fucking get it. Like, that's so unprofessional. And yeah, look. He's an incredibly handsome man. I'll say that. But I definitely see what Derek's talking about here. He's just not very lean there at all. Nice. And so you could argue maybe he wanted to have like a more commanding presence by being like huskier. And maybe he wasn't trying to go for a lean look. But like he's definitely capable of looking like he was there on the left. Yeah, now, I think he looks very good on the left. Exactly. Like, like, like that's um, – and I, I, he looks that awesome looks there to too. Yeah, yeah, I mean, it's hard to tell with the fake bruises or the real bruise, bruises, whichever is going on there. I don't know if that's makeup or like... Yeah, like the Gerard Butler, like fake ab shit. Like, how do we know what's even going oh, on? Yeah, yeah, yeah. The Gerard Butler thing is a good example um, of, of just lots of CGI and fakery, which yeah, I'm gotten, fine with. He's gotten so actually stylized. lean when he was younger, but never like this since. Yeah, that's a really strong uh, physique that he's got there. Like, like he's 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 real. That I mean, that's discipline you're seeing, right? To to get to where he is there. He yeah. looks great there in the gym when he's got a pump. It's almost like he didn't get a pump for the fucking bath scene. I don't know. Yeah, why would you not get a pump for a bath scene? Or maybe or just he a, was just maybe he's just frame. flat from like water depleting too much when he's already like too high of body fat, so he just looks like deflated almost. Yeah, yeah. It's not a. It's not a. Look, and, and I and I know this is kind of weird because like there's plenty of people out there who are like 40 pounds overweight and they're like, God, I wish I looked like Henry Cavill in a mm. bathtub. But it's what we're talking about here is like someone getting paid millions of dollars with a seemingly infinite resources, like like yeah. you know teams of people. Um, and I kind of had a similar situation, right, where I've got all the all the free time that I could have in the world. I've got you know professionals helping me, doctors, people like Derek coaching me. I'm in the, virtually the exact same situation as someone like Henry Cavill is. And I think that I would have, if I'm driving the Henry Cavill body, I think I look better in the bathtub by, by the time it's bathtub time, because I, I'm, yeah. I make it, I, I'm a little more professional about that. I don't know. I just, I think he could have looked better uh, and he doesn't, but he did look good as Superman. He looks sick as Superman. Yeah. I think he looked good as Superman, but not great. Like, no, yeah, yeah I think I think he could have done better in all of his stuff, but yeah, that was like his peak, in my opinion, of like yeah. His, uh, I mean, career. Chris Hemsworth's like the the fucking pinnacle to me of like guys who have like who weren't fitness guys who are movie stars who became fit like like obviously Schwarzenegger like nobody brought a better physique to like film and like combined being a movie star with with physique than Schwarzenegger I don't think ever, but like Hemsworth didn't used to look like that <laughs> like. <laughs> like he wouldn't look like that if you weren't in film. Uh, he look, he looks gnarly. Him and Adriani have made like the most ridiculous before and afters that consistently like maintain it. They don't just fall apart after. Yeah, and he gets bigger. He's getting bigger and yeah. Adriani loves the fucking sauce. He just loves the process for sure because he he doesn't lose like any progress. He like peaks and then he keeps going. He, doesn't, like, <laughs> and he finds a higher peak afterwards. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, yeah. too. Welcome to Mount Everest. Yeah, yeah. That's what. Uh, that's what. Um. That's what Hemsworth's done. Like, like every film, he's a bigger version of Thor. Like, it's if you go back to the first Thor, 
when uh when he's like walking around shirtless kind of in the doing desert. a little of this right he, he's like the stock market where he goes up but not every day is better than the day before uh that indian guy i can't say his name just goes yeah. up in a straight line yeah, yeah he looks know. he looks absolutely ridiculous his honestly like darker skin tone helps a lot too i i think oh, but yeah. but i'm not taking anything away from the way the man looks he looks insane but it does help mm-hmm.